It's beer o'clock on me, Low Craft Beer. I've got an interesting beer today for you guys. It's by Walthamstow Beer, and the font could be a little bit better, but it says Green Hopped Pale Ale. You can see the pale ale quite well, but maybe not so much the green hopped, especially if you're watching this review off a mobile phone. Um, it's, yeah, but it's been brewed at the East London Brewing Company, uh, for Walthamstow Beer, and yeah, the, the, is the hops are grown at the gardens and allotments of Walthamstow in London. Isn't that amazing? It's a bottle conditioned beer. East London Brewery on the top, bottle cap. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. Nice bit of smoke on the bottle opening. Beer in the glass then. Looks really nice. So green hops, I'm expecting this beer to be as fresh as a daisy. I mean, really punching through with the aroma. It's a slightly hazy beer, good levels of carbonation, two finger, white head. Let's get the aroma. don't think they're New World hops. I think it's more of a traditional British hop that they've used in the beer. It's not really punching in the aroma. Biscuit malt coming through. Let's dive in. Cheers. Lovely biscuity, bready malts coming through in the beer. It's leaning very much into the kind of the sweet aspect. Just waiting for the hops to kick in. <clears throat> it's very refreshing. There we go, that's, yeah, that's a bit better. I think traditional I'm going to say traditional British hops here. There's a bitterness on the back end. There's some lemon, um, maybe some fuggles or goldens or something. They don't say. Yeah, it's, an, it's a prickly, stinging nettle bitterness on the back end. So sweetness to begin with. We're getting there now. Sweetness to begin with. And then a nice kind of stinging nettle hop finish on the back end. Carbonation pushes the beer on the inside of the mouth. It's a very refreshing best bitter if you like Good lacing on the glass Yeah, nice bit of bitterness nice biscuit bready malts That's a look at Walthamstow beer green hopped pale ale it's not bad, it's not bad. Maybe they need to grow just a few more hops in their hop yards in Walthamstow in their greenhouses, or not greenhouses, but their, what they call it, allotments and gardens. Just get a little, I reckon a little bit more hop profile in there and that would be a, a terrific beer. As it stands right now, I think it's just lacking a touch on the hop profile there is a bitterness there there is a kind of a fuggly goldens taste going on um prickly stinging nettle but it took a couple of tastes to come through um, i was really the first taste really leaning towards a biscuity malty bready beer and i was kind of thinking where's the hops and they do come after a few tastes i like the beer to give it um i think east london brewery have produced um 
better beers than this. Um, I'm going to give it a 6 out of 10. It's a 6 out of 10 from Reload Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Oh, one second. It's not East London Brewery. It's Walthamstow Beer. So Walthamstow Beer, I think you can produce something a little bit better than this. Um, I'm not laying the blame here at uh, East London Brewery's uh, door. Uh, it's, it's actually Walthamstow Beer. So yeah, 6 out of 10. Thanks for watching. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! And cheers.